Hello po! Good morning sa lahat ng mahilig magluto at sa mga gustong matutong magluto. And dito na lang po ang inyong Mami JC. Always excited and happy to serve you! Kung mahilig kayo sa kanin, ihanda nyo na ang isang katerbang kanin dahil siguradong mapapa-exercise kayo sa ating lulutuin ngayon. Ang lulutuin ko today ay spicy breaded pork spare ribs. So, handa na ba kayo? Arap na! So, ngayon, I will introduce to you our ingredients for our spicy breaded pork spare ribs. Now, this is our main ingredient, our pork spare ribs. This is 1.2 kilos. And next, we have here our minced garlic. No? Then next, we also have here our minced onions. And then... We also have here our uh, sliced spring onions. So, kung nakikita ninyo, ito yung white, no? ito yung hard part ng spring onions. No? And now, we also have here our dried minced chili. Alam nyo ba that chilies are very high in vitamin C, which is important for wound healing and immune function. And they also have vitamin B6, which plays a role in energy metabolism. At meron pa, they also essential for blood clotting, healthy kidneys, and bones. O ba diba, hindi lamang siya basta-bastang pampasarap lang at pampagada. Kundi talagang marami tayong mga benefits na makukuha. Next, we have here our rosemary. And the next, uh, we have here our uh, sesame oil. Then, we also, by the way, I am using Lee Kum Ki uh, sesame oil. And we also have here our oyster sauce. I am also using Likum Ki, no? And we also have here our regular oil for deep frying, no? Kasi ito yung gagamitin natin para sa pag-fry natin sa pork spare ribs. And I also have here a glass of water na gagamitin natin later. And we also have here our flour, no? Gagamitin natin for dredging, no? For coating, no? So, this is 100 grams and this is good for uh, 1.5 kilos na pork spare ribs. But I only have 1.2 kilos. So, medyo tamang-tama din ito. And now, we also have here our fried minced garlic and our sliced uh, spring onions for garnishing later. At ang panghuli, ang siyang magdadagdag sa sarap ng ating spicy breaded pork spare ribs, no? I have here a spare ribs mix from McCormick, no? Uh, dati uh, nagluto ako ng spare ribs pero hindi ako gumagamit ng ganito. Then, na-discover ko ito, no? At talagang masarap na masarap. You should try this one at hindi kayo magsisisi at siguradong mapapa-extra rice kayo sa sarap. So ano na? Handa na ba kayo? Tayo na magluto ng spicy breaded pork spare ribs. So ngayon, lalagyan na natin ng regular oil ang ating paglulutuan. No? Then when waiting for this na uminit, yung make sure na talagang mainit siya para maganda ang result no? sa pag-fry sa pag natin. So uh, while waiting for this na uminit, we will start dredging no, or coating our pork spare ribs. So ngayon, I'll be using plastic gloves to make sure na malinis ang pagkakagawa natin. So i-dredge na natin ang ating uh, pork spare ribs. No? So ito na. So ilalagay natin dito. Then i-deep fry natin ang mga ito. And now, our breaded pork spare ribs are ready for deep frying. So, ito na. So, ito, mainit na mainit na to. Talagang pwede na to, no? So, uh, make sure na mainit na mainit ang oil para maganda ang kalalabasan ng ating pag-fry. So, ito na. So, ito na. So, hihintayin natin siya na magiging golden brown siya. So, narito na ang 
ating deep fried pork spare ribs. So, ready ready na. So, lulutuin na natin. Gagawa na tayo na spicy breaded pork spare ribs. So, ngayon, sisimulan na natin ang pagluluto. Ngayon, mainit na ang, na ang ating sesame oil. So, now we will saute our garlic. Then, ang kasunod ng garlic, of course, uh, isusunod natin ang ating minced onions. Okay. Ito na. So, ito na, no? So, iba talaga ang sesame oil kasi uh, mabangong-mabango siya. Talagang malalaman mo kung sesame oil ba ang uh, ginamit dahil sa kanyang amoy, no? Then, after ng ating garlic at ng ating green onions, ilalagay na natin ang ating uh, deep-fried pork steroids. So, ilalagay na natin siya dito. So, eto na. Nailagay ko na lahat. So, maglalagay tayo ng one glass of water. Okay. Then, after putting the, ano, one glass of water, we will cover it and we will let it simmer for two minutes. So, after two minutes, pwede na to. Lalagyan na natin siya ng oyster sauce. Again, I am using lecum tea. So, depende na yan sa inyo kung gaano kadami ito. Depende sa inyo sa inyong panglasa ang ilalagay ninyong oyster sauce. Then, after the oyster sauce, maglalagay tayo ng uh, rosemary. Then, after ng rosemary, maglalagay tayo ng ating dried minced chili. So, again, magdidepende din sa inyo kung gaano karami ang ilalagay ninyo. Talagang magdidepende yan sa panlasa ninyo. So, pagkatapos natin siyang lagyan ng rosemary, ng dried minced chili, at saka yung oyster sauce, we will let it simmer for another 30 seconds. So, after natin siyang lagyan ng uh, rosemary, ng dried minced chili, at saka yung ano, oyster sauce, ilalagay na natin ang ating spare ribs mix from McCormick. So, ilalagay natin dito. So, alam niyo talagang masarap ito, no? Kasi dati, di ba, sabi ko kanina na nagluto na ako ng spare ribs dati, pero hindi ako gumamit ng ganito. Then, Masyado akong happy kasi na-discover ko ito, no? You should try this at talagang hindi kayo magsisisi. So, again, I am using Spare Ribs Mix from McCormick. So, i-mix niyo siya ng maayos. Then, ilalagay na natin ang ating sliced spring onion. So, ito yung hard part, yung puti. So, eto na ang ating spicy breaded pork spare rib. So, ready na to. Pwede na natin siyang ilagay sa ating serving plate. So, eto na ang ating spicy breaded pork spare rib. So, lalagyan na natin siya. Bububura na natin siya na fried minced garlic and sliced spring onions. Eto na. So, etong ano, etong fried minced garlic. Magdadagdag siya sa ganda and of course, magdadagdag siya sa lasa at bango ng ating luto. At nilagyan ko na rin siya ng sliced spring onions. So, mas lalo siya gumanda of course. Mas nagiging attractive sa tingnan at mas lalong gaganahan yung kakain. Narito na ang ating spicy breaded pork spare ribs. At kung nagustuhan ninyo ating video today, please do not hesitate to leave your comments. And if you are new to my YouTube channel, please click like, share, and subscribe, and click the notification bell for updates. 
Once again, this is your mommy, JC. The next is having always express your love through food. See you next week. Thank you so much for watching. God bless everyone.